KFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very sunny and pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we start our day with a mixed bag. The mix goes like this. Dow's up 103. Russell's up just a few, few uh, just 39 cents, actually. Um, so that's to the upside. To the downside, it's the S&P down 8 points, NASDAQ 100, 69. Semi's off 115. Tranny's down 30. You've got gold trading up uh, 12 bucks at 23.15. Silver's up 11 cents at 26.76. Light three crude is off nearly two bucks, trading out at 80. Uh, natural gas is off seven pennies at a buck 91, and a 30-year treasury up a half a point, printed out at 114.08. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine-panel market update chart. ES Mini upper left-hand side. What do we know about it? Well, we got a consolidation with inside his profiles. Support is that really there's two support levels. There's profile support at 50.22, and there is buy the D point support, and that's down at the 49.63.50 level. Resistance, that's pretty simple. That's at the top of that profile at 51.39. With the spot volatility, it still remains above its 50 day exponential moving average. That says any rug pulls will be to the downside for sure with the ESP, but we just covered its support levels out there. For the spot fix, what you're watching is 15.21. That's the 50-day. If price closes below that, well, then we likely have a rally going on inside the S&P 500, and you'd be watching the resistance points. Inside the NQ, uh, we have a consolidation with inside its profile. No bottom signal here where we do have a bottom pattern inside of the S&P. We do not have that inside of the NQ. Support is at, 11, at 17,252, and resistance is a zone. That zone is 17,810 to 18,089. The U.S. dollar index is testing profile resistance. That's up at 106,32. If price were to close above, that then we'd see price move up to that 106.53 level that's its a to b equals cd pattern to the upside if we take a look at goldilocks gold is closed below the bottom of its daily profile yesterday trying to get back in it today it needs to close above 23 uh 7 20 i'm sorry 23 but even if it doesn't it's got support at 22.78.70 in the case of silver it's trading right now below daily and weekly profile support its next area of support is at 26.15 that's its weekly bottom of its well that's interesting. So I've got two different profile levels out here. So I've got one of the white background systems at 2615, and we'll still use that. Below that, its breakout area would be down at the 2411. That is from the daily time frame. If we get lights recruited and it closes below 80, 70 data, it's going to trigger an A to B equals CD pattern to the downside. 78.19 would be its price target. Natural gas is dead money. Just got a sideways consolidation. And pretty much the same thing with regard to the 30-year Treasury. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Zed Show if you would. We're about to start your Wednesday. Please have a wonderful one. Thanks for joining us. We look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now. In the world of